good early morning. We're so glad you're here. We daily vlog, so if you like this video, come back tomorrow. We are at the bus stop waiting for the bus to Epcot. It says seven minutes. It is a chilly 57 degree morning, mm -hmm. but we have our frozen. Full, our full Epcot deck. Frozen and Cosmic yeah. Rewind. Yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Dance, 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 dance. Boom, 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 boom. Then she was just dancing the moment he got in and saw a spaceship first. It's a glorious morning. Yeah. Knows when he's with his people, his ancestral home, Canada. Where are you going? We gotta get coffee and meet up with your cousins. Wow! Friends, I got my Joffreys. I have no idea where any of my family members are, but I had to show you this view. If heaven is something in your mind that you imagine it to be, this is my heaven. When I die one day, ideally very, very long from now, this is just where I'll be. All right, so the park is officially opened and in that extra 30 minutes, all we accomplished was a Joffrey's Coffrey. A full tour of Canada. A full tour of Canada and letting our son run around a completely empty world showcase. Mm -hmm. That is an A++ in my book. So the Sakards are actually with us now. We're going to hit up Creations and maybe Spaceship Earth before our very early Cosmic Rewind. Grant is the MVP of the day. He was the one in charge because he's the only person in MDX who can see everybody in our party. I don't know why. So he I don't know how. He was but I'm important. He was the person who was chosen to do Cosmic Rewind and our Genie Plus. Frozen? Yeah, I did. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> that thespian in him came out. Oh yeah. <laughs> Christina's gr favorite. We're going in creations. They've never you guys have never seen it. My finger was tapping so fast. I'm I I, I, I was like that. I was I'm gonna if I'm being honest, I told Sarah that because you can buy You can buy, you can like buy $14. Cosmic, so I told Sarah because she really wants to go on it. I was like if Grant doesn't if Grant doesn't get the job done, we'll buy it for you to go on it. I love how everyone not, trusts me. And I'm just, I don't trust myself to do it. It's very okay. hard. But like you not only got a great early, ridiculously early Cosmic Rewind time, you also got a decent Frozen ever, or Frozen ride. I forget what game there was on the, it was like on, on the phone where you had to like tap really, really quick. And you were great at it? Oh yeah. I believe that. And that's what I was doing. Yeah, let's, get to, let's get you a sweatshirt. Let's go. You know we had to stop here. I'm gonna bow to each other definitely. I told her it's kind of like root beer, but it's really not. Okay. Am I giving this to him? <laughs> yeah, I'll get you. He tricked you. I'll get you, a, I'll get you a. I'll get you a. I'll get you a sweet one, okay? That How was not be? nice, Uncle Peter. How was it? Yuck. <laughs> Yuck. <laughs> that was not nice, Daddy. I have donut on my dress, but Teddy's taking a snooze. Oh 
Oh my gosh. Teddy's first time on Spaceship where he's snoozing. Five minute wait. Wait, you said it No, we didn't go on it in July. We're terrible parents. done going on Cosmic Rewind, so we are getting flavors of fire. Sarah and I are getting each our own corned beefs before we hit up World Showcase. We have a fast pass for Frozen, and then we're gonna eat a bunch of food, because that's what you do. I know we showed it the other day, but it's worth showing every single time. Here's the corned beef. I got a 12-ounce beer this time. Sarah's already started to devour We got our own, hers. and yeah. I needed to eat it immediately. I think we all do. I think, I think we're gonna eat more than this, too. Yeah. James will hopefully fall asleep in a nap soon. Lightning Lane, Frozen Ever After. James, he's never really been on it as like. He's very excited. As a toddler who can understand. We're gonna he's go. Saying go. He's saying go, go, go. to see the troll. Yeah! Your grandpa loved this troll. Ooh, poke him. Yeah, look at him. It's gotten warmer out and something very big is about to happen that Sarah and I have been waiting years for. More Dale of Norway restock. New styles. Let's go. Alright, so mine's got little reindeers and Christmas trees on it. And then Sarah's has got some floral beautifulness. Snowflakes, snowflakes. Look at these. Gorgeous. These were not here for the longest time. We said we'd get them. Basically, this is our birthdays and Christmases right here. We walked past Mariak Chikobri, Cobra, and James just started jamming, so we're gonna go back and see him. All right, we have one baby asleep, and Teddy is fighting his nap. Sarah's trying to get him down, and as we were getting somewhere, this wonderful street performer came to put on a wonderful show, but not cognizant to napping, so we are scurrying away. But if you're ever in Epcot, please watch these shows, and whatever country offers them, they're amazing. Sarah's coordinating two phones, trying to find our two different parties, and trying to set up vlog live. All while trying to put Teddy down for a nap because she is Wonder Woman. Have I been successful in any of these? You've ones? been 45% successful in all of them, so that's 130%. <laughs> so you're doing great. Okay. He's literally I on the verge our... of bursting into a ball of Z's like in a <laughs> like in a yeah. comic book. Yes, I think I think that's what we need to prioritize. Yeah. Tick a lock, a tick a lock, a tick a boom. Hey, I'm an Epcot baby. Oh, oh, oh. I'm an Epcot baby. Oh, 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 oh. 
Also, Teddy got a second tooth since we've been here. It's the side on the top. Oh. Oh. He's a vlogging baby. You got, you got, you got <laughs> he's a vlogging baby. He's a vlogging baby. Huh. So he's gotten two new teeth since we've been here. All right, Sarah is very close to having Teddy down for a nap. Finally calm. We're in Japan, debating on what we're gonna do for Food of Fortune Festival because it's a, the, it's coming to an end. It's the very last weekend. Or if we'll do like a full-on quick service. Yeah. Um, do you want to go in Japan? We skipped it the other night. I'm kind of hungry. I want to get food. Okay. All right, I found something. I wanted this is a frozen mint tea all of this is from Morocco um, this mint tea though was over at that little window and then this was at Tangerine Cafe so this is stone ground pita with some dippins and then a lamb kebab with little little chickpea salad no, chillin villain but we're gonna do pink right Ooh. Yeah. baby's getting her face painted Wow, that was so fast. Let's take a picture really quick for you. They're getting ready for the holidays, getting ready for Striganona. The pizza window is open, and I'm gonna get some, also a lemoncello mule, and I love this little nook. Wow, we got some pizza. It was actually open, and Peter got a lemoncello mule. Christina got a blueberry slush. I think that blueberry is my like favorite flavor of things. Really? Wow. Ah. Is it delish? Uh-oh. <laughs> He's really giving all those top teeth. Three years ago, I like it. James, he's finally awake. Is it good? Could we just talk about how beautiful the pavilion looks right now? This golden hour going on. Teddy! Everybody's awake now. Chaos is rightfully ensuing in the best way. Shingity ching, hee haw, hee haw. It's Dominic the donkey. Cause it's Christmas time! Grant, do you know who Dominic the donkey is? Yeah. Who is he? It's a soccer player from the 70s. Yep, there you go. This is why Grant is my 14th favorite person in my life. <laughs> Just kidding, you're like top 10. Yes, finally! Yeah, he is in awe because we thought the pavilion was beautiful. Look at World Showcase during Golden Hour. Wow. James had two and a half hours of rest. Now he's ready for some food and wine. Food and wine. James, he loves some food and wine. Yeah. All right, it's 5.30 almost. We're in Japan Pavilion. We had some lot of motions just now. So I'm chilling with James. Everybody else moves on to Morocco. Hey, these are long days in Disney and kids and adults are allowed to have loud and quiet emotions throughout the whole trip. So just kind of kind of mitigate it as we go and just know that it's part of the game, right? We're doing good. He's got Miss Rachel on right now. Yay! Jamesy, mesmerized by the French Pavilion Fountain. And eating a snack. We gotta get some dinner. It may not be the festival of the holidays yet, but our spoded teapot is out. Epcot is definitely livening up. And uh, I got a harp from the outdoor because I it was busy in Rosen Crown, so sorry Air Hearts, but I was solo with the stroller and James. Thought it'd be kind of irresponsible to leave him outside in the stroller. And I wasn't gonna fight him back in. So I got an outside drink and I think I'm gonna meet up with the crew. Actually, there they are. Wild animal number two, wild animal number one. We're in the Canada Pavilion. 
It's the last pavilion to check up. Oh, you know, actually we have to go to Mexico, which we're doing next, and then we're done. So we have to ride Grand Fiesta Tour before Harmonious. Now, if you thought this thing was beautiful during the daytime, it is truly beautiful at nighttime. Hold on to your bunny, okay? What? Do you think it's beautiful, Violet? Excuse me, sorry. It's an angel. Whoa! James doesn't even realize right now that all this for Dilly de los Muertos is his birthday. Wow! Showtime, I think. Yep. We're gonna get a spot early. We're gonna get a spot we're early for multiple reasons. One, so it's a good spot. Two, so that we can all chill. Yep. And collectively, yep. between our three families here, we're like ready to have a home base so that we can all like run and go get drinks or snacks or food or bathrooms and just be in one spot. Yeah. That'd be great. We just gotta get there. Yeah. Perfect. Round. 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 Oh, yeah, it's round Two? as could be. No. He found himself on the camera. <laughs> and I'm gonna get you, 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 get you. Do you want some pizza? Again? Want some more pizza? We're back at the pizza window. <laughs> Listen, we've missed this. It's never open for us. Yeah. So we're and we're gonna get our own pizza. Are you getting pizza? Okay. You see my camera? Oh. Are you gonna eat pizza? Pizza round two. Sarah's margarita, my pepperoni. James and I are gonna go to the bathroom. And here's our spot for Harmonious. Lauren got her pizza, her pizza ears, and now we're happy. Okay, Ted, you'll be happy you too. You want some pizza? <laughs> James definitely takes after his mom and is a pyromaniac. He's just eyeing the fire all the way out. This is Epcot. We will not be doing a classic Earhart World Showcase plus route tonight. We are beelining the beach club. We're gonna try to pick up a minivan there and have a smooth transition home. But look at that. 
magical place on earth. Great, this is the anthem of the 50th anniversary. Brilliant. Did you like Harmonious with the screens? My family is the biggest Harmonious uh, fan club ever. That better include like the Brookhards as your family. Because sure. if it doesn't, you're surely fucked. You watched my son that whole show. I know. <laughs> he was freaking out. Crescent Lake. It is the creme de la creme of Walt Disney World. Creme de la creme. How was Harmonious for you? Fabulous. Who is like core memory? Beach Club all Christmasy. It's cool. They're all themed the different princesses. Jasmine, Cinderella, Snow White. Belle and Tiana. So nice. We took a minivan from the beach club to Saratoga. And it was so easy and nice and uneventful, which was great. So we will be honest today. We did, might not have vlogged as much just because both boys really were just kind of having like moments or just like having a, you know i don't know what you would yeah yeah big emotions um and so in those moments we you know we hadn't we didn't have the camera out um but it's still you know those days still exist on vacation um and you know just because you're here doesn't mean that real life stops either so um I'm not sure this might be a little bit shorter than than these trip vlogs have been, but that is okay. And um, we had many redeeming moments today, many highs um, as well. So our hearts are happy. I am so tired. I could literally close my eyes and fall asleep right now. We're all winding down in our comfies. And we are going to bed. It is good to be home. We know what our goals are, we know what we hope to accomplish, and believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>